I think uh, it's too early to talk about uh, the end result yet. It's still Thursday. Uh, tomorrow the matches are starting, so you know I just I want to pay the right respect to the you know to our opponents. Uh, I don't want to say any any number or any matches or something like this. We're all here for one cause, and it's to win, to compete. And you know that's a that's a nice tie, and it's, it's good to have that fair play. So I wouldn't I wouldn't call any uh, you know any side. So let let the best team win. You know anything can happen in any situations, and uh, we don't have to do, you know you don't have to think uh, well ahead of yourself. So uh, no no, but everyone is happy. Everyone is uh, is in a good mood. Very positive. Great weather. Great place. So uh, you know let the game begin. Starting at one. It will be Grigor Dimitrov. Grigor Dimitrov. The number one, Grigor Dimitrov. The only thing I, I wanted to do and I knew what to do was play tennis. So I really. You know, took all my eggs and put it right into those, you know, that basket that was there. So I, to me, it was never an option. But if you know, it's it's all about dedication. At some point, you know, you're gonna reach a point when you're 16, 17, 18, and you start having a little bit of good results, and you kind of gotta make a decision. But once you make that decision, there's no uh, there's no way, you know, that you can get out of it. So you you have to. You know, you have to listen to your gut feeling. It's 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 definitely one of the most important things, and and like this, you can actually discover what kind of person you are. And с абсолютно законно самочувствие се гордея, защото гледам един прекрасен млад мъжки отбор по тенис и най-вече с Григор Димитров, който при цялата си натоварна програма той е тук, играе и подкрепя своите колеги. Аз съм много щастлива, защото на живо аз между другото за първи път съм в чужбина, когато нашите момчета играят отборно. Иначе съм имала така уникалния шанс да гледам Григор на състезания извън България. Но най-много това, което ме зарадва, че всички те играха с много дух, с много самочувствие. Имаше адски много българи тук на трибуните и много ги подкрепиха. И това така ми дава частица самочувствие и това да мисля, че такива млади спортисти, талантливи като Григор, могат да обединат една цяла нация като България. I think first of all everyone is is very individual for himself. Um, it takes, I think, it takes years to really starting to get to know yourself first of all, and and on what exactly you need to focus on with the right person, with the right team. Uh, man, I wish I wish I could tell you the right formula, but there's no such a thing as the right formula except that you gotta find your own path in your own comfort zone. Um, regardless, whether it's going to be on the court, whether it's going to be in the gym, so you always got to find your best, uh, uh, your best zone. I mean, uh, if, if, uh, if I say, let's say I've been working in the office and I've been working eight hours a day, but maybe he needs to work less than that, or it's just, it depends on how your body is reacting, but, but you know, it's all, it's all about that, that, that practice, that extra, that is going to make the biggest difference in the, in the match, and, you know, there's going to be one shot that you got to make. Η επιστροφή στο σερβίς ήταν το δύσκολο κομμάτι για μένα. Δηλαδή το σερβίς του πιένει πιο γρήγορα από τα σερβίς που έχω συνειδήσει εγώ στο παιχνίδι που παίζουμε και στο επίπεδο που παίζουμε. Τα σίγουρα και στο, στην baseline ήταν πολύ καλύτερος από αυτούς που συνειδήσει. Γενικά όλα τα έχουμε, αλλά κυρίως στο σερβίς του. Δηλαδή στην επιστροφή είχα... Εντάξει πιστεύω είναι σημαντική εμπειρία. Που... Σημαντική εμπειρία. Παίρνω εμπειρίες παίζοντας με, με τέτοιους αθλητές. Εντάξει, ε, 
ε, ε, αυτοπεποίθηση που μπορώ, βλέπω ότι μπορώ να σταθώ για, κάποι, για ένα μισή σετ τουλάχιστον σε αυτό το επίπεδο. Εντάξει, αυτά. Έπαιξε πολύ σημαντικό ρόλο το πρώτο σετ. Έπαιξε σημαντικό ρόλο γιατί τα παιδιά, η Βούλερ είχαν ξεκινήσει κάπω ε, λίγο παθητικά. Εμεί είχαμε μπει με τον Μάρκο πολύ καλά, σερβίραμε πολύ καλά, κάναμε πολύ καλά χτυπήματα. Οπότε, κατά τη γνώμη μου, το πρώτο σετ ήταν αρκετά σημαντικό για την εξέλιξη του παιχνιδιού. Θα μπορούσε να ήταν πολύ διαφορετικό αν είχαμε πάρει το πρώτο σετ εμεί για δύο-τρει πόντου, δεν ήταν τρει λεπτομέρειε. Οπότε, τότε θα είχαν και μεγαλύτερη πίεση οι ίδιοι. Και εμεί βεβαίω θα, θα αποδίδαμε καλύτερα. Είναι πολύ εύκολο να είσαι να είσαι σε αυτή την ευκαιρία. Είναι πολύ εύκολο να είσαι σε αυτή την ευκαιρία. You have to, uh, you know, do play your game, uh, do what's uh, do what's best, and in the end of the day, I mean, tennis is, I mean, in general, any sport is an expression of, of you know, of, of emotions, and and it's 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 a great if you can put, you know, if you give an input to uh, to young kids or uh, or people or to to be some kind of inspiration, it's it's always a always a good deed, and I think that's. That's important in our society nowadays. I mean, it's it's just great to play with a player with at Grigor's level. Uh, it's it's very fun to play, and it's also you can see the difference between good players and uh, and very good players. When uh, whenever you need the point, he always comes up with some good shots. A perfect example of that was the last game. Uh, They played a good point. We go down luck 15, and then I think it was 15-30, uh, and then he just comes up with three big serves and uh, serves out the match, and it just you know goes to show you what uh, players of his level can do. And that that was happening in, uh, throughout the entire match, and uh, that was just it was just a lot of fun to be part of it. Най-вълно нещо нещо за момента е, защото не сме мацки, мацки много хора. Интересът е голем, което е, ам, което е добре. Мисля, което е, е добре не само за нас, но, но и за тениса като цяло. I think first of all that everyone has been really fair today on the court, which is, which is a nice thing to see. You don't see uh, tournaments nowadays where the, where the public and the audience are actually always cheering one way. And it's actually nice to see this fair play, and and you know it, it was a great surrounding, I think, from both ends, which is which is what tennis is all about. At some point, and I think very often we forget what it is and and what's a, what is it about. You know, it's about two players coming on court, and you know, let's see who's got the you know the better day out of it. So, on one side, I can say this about it, and on the other, I'm always pleasantly surprised when I'm going to a country that I haven't been in a in a while. Uh, So, well, you guys are our neighbors anyway, so it, uh, it, it's kind of, it's a mutual and, and, and it's a warm feeling. So that's, um, uh, I think all of that, it's, it's, in a positive, it's in a positive way and let's hope that we have a, a great experience as well. I think there's nothing more and nothing stronger than my own expectations, more than any, what anyone else would tell me, or if any, if I would hear something else, I'm not that type of a guy that is going to sit down and read what what the people are saying and what the people want me to do or what this and what that. I'm I've never been like this, uh, and I'm not looking to be like this. I think the the the, the best thing I can do is uh, really work my own way. Uh, try to try to count on myself and and just doing what I believe in and if it happens it happens it might never happen I might you know I might never be able to pass number 15 uh, but you have to put yourself in a position that you have given a hundred percent from yourself 
And if it doesn't happen, well, then it doesn't. But at least you know you've, you've given yourself a best shot.